there are a number of common complications that users tend to come across with the Syntex fuel flow kits. Most of these problems will cause the unit to show an inaccurate reading. Here are a couple of tips for how to troubleshoot. If the unit is not powering up, the most common issue is that it is not getting the correct power supply. Check that the unit is receiving greater than 12 volts and that there is no damaged or bad connections. If this does not solve the problem, contact our support team. If you are getting inaccurate readings, the first thing to check is that you have correctly entered the pulse settings from the side of the pulse meters. Also ensure that you have correctly placed the in in the in and the out in the out. Please see our setup video for full information on this. If the readings are still not accurate, you will need to ensure that the air is bled from the system. As per the instructions, the pulse meter should be placed at the highest point in the system. By releasing the bolts on the pulse meters with the system running, the air should slowly bleed from the system. If the unit is not receiving a signal from one of the pulse meters, first check that the connection is firm and that there are no breaks in the wire. The next step is to check if the pulse meter is blocked. To do this, blow through the pulse meter. You should hear the gears spinning. Do this again with the unit powered up and the counter should go up on the display. If the gears are spinning but you are not getting any reading or if the gears are not spinning at all, you will need to open up the pulse meter. Whenever you open up the pulse meter, it is always worth checking the seal ensuring that there is no damage to either side. After that, you are looking for one of two things. The first is that there is no debris in the gears. It is usually easiest to remove the gears to ensure that the meter is clear. There are also two magnets that should be facing up. This is the second item that you should be checking. If the gears are spinning but you are not getting a reading, this is usually the cause. When replacing the gears, ensure that they are at right angles. Close the case and tighten. For further information, please contact our warranty team via email or see the website at www.syntex.com.au.